Hello and welcome back to my YouTube channel. In today's video, I want to teach you some different ways to say yes and no. But I'd like to do it in a fun way. Uh, this, this video will show you some common and advanced ways to do this. Knowing how to say things in different ways can help your listening, it can help your understanding, and it certainly can help your fluency because you can learn how to use them. Because I know that students feel frustrated when they hear things, they can hear words, but they don't know what, they're, what they mean. They don't understand what it is. And that can really get in your way of whatever you want to try and do, whatever it, you're going to school or you're traveling or you just want to get better at English. Okay, so the knowledge of vocabulary can really help you improve. So this video is going to ask you 10 fun questions. <laughs> then I'll show you a different way to say yes and no. Then you choose one in your mind. You just choose yes or no, and then I'll tell you what's ha what happens afterwards, okay? I hope you'll like these funny jokes. At the end of the video, you're going to see some listening questions, so stick around and watch the whole thing, alrighty? So, the first question is, do you want to go out to dinner tonight? And you can say, oh my god, yes, or Sorry, no. What's your answer? And here's where we went to dinner. <laughs> Are you happy about that or not? Okay, here is question number two. Have you gained a little weight lately? And you can say precisely or certainly not. And your answer, and then here's a picture of what I meant. You look fantastic. Wow. <laughs> All right. So we've only made it a short way into this video, but I still wanted to give you a secret code. Now, what's a secret code? This is a phrase that I want you to send to me on Instagram at Teacher Joe Crossman then I'll know that you watched this video, you've seen it this far, and you are a student that I should chat with more. Okay, I'm trying to help you learn more English. So the, <laughs> the first secret code is lots of muscles. Send that to me in a direct message and I'll know that you're a good student. But let's not stop, let's keep going. S question number three. Can you come over to my place tonight? And you could say, yep, I'll be right there. Or, I need to bow out. And <laughs> here's what happened at my place. So are you happy with your answer? Number four, can you help me move this weekend? So you can say, no problem. I'm always ready to help, or not likely. <laughs> All right, and here is what happened when I had to move. <laughs> Number five, do you wish to give to a charity? And you can say, yeah, I'd be happy to, or thanks for thinking of me, but I can't. All right, and here's the charity <laughs> that you might be giving to. Are you happy with your answer? All right, question number six. Do you think I am a good teacher? Indubitably, or not really. And... <laughs> Here's my picture afterwards. <laughs> All right. And in case you didn't know, indubitably means without question. All right. Number seven. Are you going to get a cute tattoo? 
most assuredly, or it's not my thing. And here's a picture of the cute tattoo. So are you glad you got it or didn't get it? <laughs> All right. Now here is the second secret code. You've made it a long way in this video. I want you to keep going. But here is the second secret code. It is so cute. All right. And let's keep going. Question number eight. Can you drive me to the airport tomorrow? You got it. Or maybe another time. Okay. And here's a picture about the drive to the airport. So maybe you're, maybe you're happy with your answer. Maybe not. Number nine. Can I borrow your car this weekend? Yeah, sure. Here you go. And you give me the keys. Or when hell freezes over. So that means no, never. And here's what happened. <laughs> Are you glad? Okay. And here's the last question. The last set of ways to say yes and no. Do you think you are the best student? Affirmative. By no means. All right. And here's what I think. All right. So those are all the, the 10, <laughs> 10 different ways to say yes and 10 different ways to say no. Now, you got to remember, don't say yes every time because sometimes the results are bad. Which of these new ways of saying yes and no do you like the best? Tell me down below. Also, how many right choices did you make? Did you make any bad choices? Because <laughs> some of these questions turned out badly. All right. The next thing we're going to do is some true or false listening questions. Okay. All right. But before we get to that, here is the third secret code. And it is Joe always tells the truth. <laughs> All right. Now, listen carefully to these uh, true or false statements and try to remember the questions and pictures that you just saw and see if these statements are true or false. OK, here we go. Number one. Joe crashed your car. Is that true or false? Number two, that tattoo was not actually cute. Is that true or false? And number three, many movie stars were at Joe's place. Is that true or false? <laughs> All right. So tell me down below if you think they were true or false, and I'll tell you if you're right or not. And if you want to keep uh, listening, here's another link to keep learning more English, uh, improving your skills, and getting better at English as fast as you can. All right. Just click on that. You'll see a different beard, and you'll uh, maybe see a different shirt. I don't know. <laughs> All right. And by the way, I'm glad the weekend is here. All right, everybody. That's it for now. See you later.